here with Logan Kenny. Uh, who was the inspiration for me styling my hair this way today? What do you do to yours, man? It looks really feathery right now. You know, I don't. A lot of people ask if I condition it. I really don't. There's no two-in-one conditioner or anything. It's just straight shampoo. And I have, I guess I have really thin hair, so I don't know. I guess that kind of plays into it, but it just kind of starts flipping up at the end and get a little bit of a comb in it just to make sure it does that. And a little bit of product in it. Um, nothing super crazy, but, you know, it gets the job done. Yeah. Giving you some serious love over there on the sidelines. Oh my God. You don't know any of those men, do you? I don't know who they are. How'd you feel about the game today, man? Uh, that's the smallest margin of victory for the Roughnecks. Really? Okay. Um, I felt We felt great going into it. You know, we went up 8-7 after the first quarter. We were feeling good. And then I feel like going into the second and third quarter, just made a few um, mistakes, um, very uh, fixable mistakes, I guess you could say. Uh, a couple drops, just a couple throwaways. And that was definitely a difference in these kind of games uh, with these really good teams and really tight competition. Uh, it's just a team that makes the least amount of mistakes like that. And yeah. We just happen to make a few more. Very small margin for error out there. We saw some big moments from you out there. Yeah, I felt, I felt pretty good out there. Um, warming up, my throws didn't feel too good, honestly. Um, but got out there for the first, first uh, disc I caught, middle of the field. I uh, looked up and saw Mike busting deep, and he's sort of a uh, guy I'm used to throwing to with tough uh, UT for the Frisbee team. And so dirty I was like, Mike. Yeah, Dirty Mike, yeah. And so I was like, you know what? I'll throw it up to him, give him a chance to run it down, and he did. Right on. And from there, it just kind of went, and I felt good the rest of the day. Uh, we were told that we should start calling you the hair. I don't really like that. It's a little too simple. Yeah. We're just going to Frenchify it like we okay. did with Percival. Yeah. Okay. Now we're going to call you Le <laughs> I like it. That's that's good. That's good. I think it sounds good, yeah. Okay. It's a little bit more, yeah, it's a little bit more character, I feel like. Yeah. And you are a character, sir. Oh, wow. And we want to do you justice. Thank you. Hey, Le Thank you for talking to Thank us. You very great much. game today. Go, great. Soul. Thanks, dude. It. Dr. Flatball here. We got the skinny on Roughnecks HQ. And believe it or not, we're pretty sure we got a we got a means to an in right now. There might just be a key. Oh, would you look, would you look at that? Okay. It's more complicated than I got it. No. Okay. It is a rarity, a rarity that you're afforded the opportunity to walk into the lair of the beast, the nest of the falcon. Anyway, we're here, we're probably gonna squander this. We're gonna kind of milk it. Let's see what we find. There's a random door, I'm sure we'll check that out later. There's a beer on my shelf. Pretty swanky little bachelor pad. So we got a little hallway here. Seems to be a bedroom in the end. Huh. What have we here? There's a couple of telltale signs here, folks. One, we got the Colorado Mama Bird patch. Right there. Boom. Tough acting to acting. That's 100% Mickle right there. Mickle's always been a chafer. Don't ask me how I know that. <laughs> Seriously. This is interesting. A lot of people's bedside tables have a lamp, or maybe like a glass of water for the middle of the night, or a uh, Sudoku book. SPF 30, that's not gonna do me any good. Snyder's pan over, everything. Flavored pretzels. Oh, that is nice. 
Pilates moves. I like that one. <laughs> Corkscrew. Yeah. Got the mattress, which, uh, you know, a whole colony of bed bugs under there. Leave them be. Okay. I know where we are. Look, I've heard all the rumors. I hear he has seven toes on his left foot. I hear he wants to drown a man in melted ice cream. I hear that when he was seven, he went to Disney World three times in one month. It's fucking insane. Interesting. What's his tooth pressure? Ridiculous ordering of clothing. It'd be a real shame if something happened to the nice orderly setup he's got going on here. Okay. Now we're talking. Now this is a real burglary. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. Clearly the best setup here. Nice big shower, a lot of room to move. Good, good free range of movement in there. Hi, I trapped a cockroach under here two weeks ago. Sorry, Jess. We got some blue liquid. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably Roughnecks Performance Enhancement Gel, so we're just gonna get rid of that. This looks nice, this looks like about my size. God. Finally, just what we've been looking for. Some Dallas, Robin Hour bullshit. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. How stupid. There we go. Okay, we saw the house. I've had a few of these. It's time to fucking hit. Oh. I'm serious, man. I'll see you in just a second. I'll see you in just a second.